I just got back from testing out the new Paul Macbeth driver, the Hades, and also the Paige Pierce putter, the Fierce. I haven't seen a whole lot about these discs before this because I wanted to come at it with a fresh perspective. Also, sometimes my throat gets altered when I know what a disc is supposed to be doing. So we're going to start with the Hades. Previously, I had a Zeus in my bag that was pretty flippy, a lot more flippy than most of them, and I was able to get a lot of distance on it, and it was pretty much my go-to, and it was also pretty reliable in the wind, and I was able to put a lot on it, a lot of torque on it, and it wouldn't lose control, but I lost it, so now I'm just bagging a couple other Zeus's that are slightly more stable, and also a Z Thrasher for when I need a turnover shot, a long turn turnover shot. So... This one was actually my very first drive that I've thrown since Sunday. Today is Thursday. I didn't warm up or anything, and it went 370 feet. My finger's also still a little bit sore from a cortisone shot a couple days ago, so I was really impressed with the distance this got. It had a great turnover flight, similar to my Thrasher, but not quite as flippy, and it had a little bit of fade at the end, so I guess that got helped it get that extra distance. The thing I like about this in comparison to the Z Thrasher is that with that disc, I feel like I have to have more control when I'm going for that distance. I can't put a whole lot of torque on it because I will flip it over too much. This one, I feel like I can put a lot on it and even though it's going to get that turn, it's not going to dump into the ground. I was only able to throw a couple throws because I'm still sore, but I'm really looking forward to getting out to the field and really putting something on it and trying to get some serious distance with it because I know that it can handle it. So the putter, the Fierce, it's beadless. I don't like beadless putters, and I never have, so I didn't really know how I was gonna feel about this, but I was still excited to try it. I actually threw it with a power grip, so I just drove it, and it went 300 feet, and it went straight. So a lot of times when you throw putters, you have to be careful because when you drive them like that, you gotta be careful because they're gonna turn over, and I feel like I put a lot of power behind this, and it still held that nice straight line. So it's actually a great putter uh, for driving, at least. I've never, I haven't putted with it, but both of them were really great, and I'm looking forward to getting out and trying them some more when I'm feeling better and in some different conditions. So thank you. <laughs>